What's going on guys, D-Legend here again. We are here with another Kingdom Hearts Union Cross video. Today we are going to be doing some stuff with our sum sum medals that we've been farming non-stop um, from the raid event this week. So this is the original sum sum that I got from the original banner that it came out like probably a year and a half ago by now. Um, it came out around the same time that traits came out or near the time that traits came out. So that was pretty cool. Um, and this metal was never really meta, to be honest with you, but the fact that it, it did ignore our target's attributes and lowered target's defense um, was huge back in the day. And obviously none of these tier 4 medals were that great, but the tier 5 Sora and Riku was really good. Um, unfortunately, I'll never be able to get a copy of that because I'm not going to buy a VIP this week. But um, honestly, like, pretty cool event that they're doing um for this raid week because it's not raid week it's not like deluxe ranking week but it's raid week in the sense that might as well raid and farm some of these things so for these medals i'm gonna be trying my best to get um some raid traits on these guys because once i evolve them to supernova and then supernova plus they'll be actually decent raid medals um for the time being so especially this one here i want as a raid medal um, and that's because I don't have too many raid medals, so if I could get five raid traits on this medal, that'd be lit. Or we can just get strength and, um, and extra attack up, apparently. Oh, that's a terrible guilt. Let's get a raid trait, though. Oh my word. Okay, that's that's that for now, I guess. We're gonna reroll this because 66% is on the very, very, very low end of the spectrum. Don't want to waste too many mirrors and other things. We're gonna just keep rolling, I guess, until we get closer to 130. Not what we want, so we're gonna skip that. I mean, like, I'm never going to use this metal for anything other than potentially raiding, so... In my opinion, it's a useless metal unless I have five raid traits on it. Which, at this rate, is not going to happen, but luckily we have two other metals that we can try with. Just give me a raid trait. There we go. So we'll start off by doing that. And then we do have... Five more traits for him for at the, for the time being. So we'll go ahead and try again so we can save some resources in the terms of mirrors. <coughs> Bang. One, one, one. Okay, that's trash. See what happens here. Okay, one extra percent. Nice. Let's get another raid trade though. Okay. We'll move on to another metal for now. After this one. Actually, might as well roll them all because I want to save some inventory space so I can farm more. Ooh, an extra 7%, not bad. Okay, traits are Garbo, though. Uh, at this point, I might as well just mirror him. Because in case I get a uh, raid trait, then I can save that strength. Sweet. Let's evolve you. Oh, I don't have enough tier 4 evolved fair, um, blue fairies to get all of them to. Um, what's it called at this point in time? Uh, to 7 stars at this point in time. But after we do this, we'll evolve to Supernova. And then Supernova Plus. 
I don't know if it just goes straight to Supernova Plus, actually. I have to check. Ugh. Oh, it only has three rage. I don't, oh, yeah, this one. Oh, my gosh. I don't want that. I'm actually going to skip that. Which is rare of me, because I... Okay, what we're going to do is... Get them all maxed out, leveled first, so we can evolve, and then rule some more traits. Does he go Supernova Plus right away? Just Supernova. Oh my god, you need five of them? That blows. Okay, never mind my dream of getting... Oh, I guess it, that does make sense to get him to Supernova for... Because he's technically just an old metal that they're re-releasing and revamping. So I guess that makes sense, but that really does suck. That there's this barrier behind it. I mean, obviously, I can farm a bunch of copies, but I would still have to waste considerable resources to get them all to seven stars. So maybe I'm giving up on the dream now, but I don't know, guys. <laughs> this kind of sucks. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try to get an extra thirty copies so I can get these guys evolved, right? I don't know what the answer is. And then also, like, I would still need traits for him, right? So that kind of sucks, and I wouldn't have the inventory space, so I guess I'm giving up on the dream. We are just gonna... We are going to... Either hold on to them, or else just roll them, get them to seven stars, and then be happy. What's... What do you guys, what do you guys think the plan should be? Should I get VIP so I can just get these guys and hopefully raid with them? Who knows? Um, let me know in the comments below what you guys want me to do. And maybe I'll do it, because... It's kind of sad right now. I do have nine copies of this guy as traits. That's pretty cool. Um, but if I wanted to raid with any of them, I'd probably want this guy as my raid metal because he'd fit onto my fairy stars, which I currently raid with. And he would go right there. Um, no raid trait for him, but AB10 max. Lux plus. So, And then some <clears throat> raid traits scattered for these guys, but this guy's absolute garbage at this point in time. So I guess I could replace him, but I need some raid medals, so let me know what you guys want me to do in the comments below. Um, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe for more Kingdom Hearts Union Cross content, and I will catch you all in the next one. Peace, guys.